Amber Heard appeals the verdict against Johnny Depp. In the defamation case against her ex-husband Johnny Depp, Amber Heard has filed an appeal seeking for a reversal of the judgment or a completely new trial. Johnny Depp filed his own formal appeal for some of the verdict less than a month ago. For a 2018 Washington Post opus ed in which she discussed domestic violence, Depp sued Heard for $50 million. Depp claimed it was inferred that he was the abuser even though she did not specifically name him. Heard filed a counterclaim against Depp for $100 million, claiming that he had stoked a smear campaign against her. The jury found in June that Heard had falsely accused Depp on all three counts. Heard received $2 million in compensatory damages while Depp received $10 million in compensatory damages and $5 million in punitive damages. Judge Penny Askerud of the trial court is currently under fire from Heard's attorneys. According to a last-month filed appeal by J. Ward Brown and David L. Axelrod, the trial court erroneously refused to dismiss this action on the grounds of forum nonconvenience based on its mistaken conclusion that Depp's claims arose in Virginia because the Washington Post servers are located here. Deadline reports. The trial court erred in rejecting Heard's demur that the contested remarks are non-actionable expressions of opinion and are not reasonably capable of conveying the alleged defamatory meaning, they said. According to the news source, the lawyers went on to criticize Judge Ascarat for excluding highly probative evidence and by admitting irrelevant and prejudicial evidence, saying that that holding, if allowed to stand, undoubtedly will have a chilling effect on other women who wish to speak about abuse involving powerful men. According to Daily Mail, Depp's legal team argues in his appeal that the only count of defamation against Heard on which he was found guilty was erroneous. Mr. Depp was entirely vindicated and had his reputation restored by the jury's unequivocal favorable verdict on all three of the defamatory claims stated in his suit, his attorneys wrote in the filing. According to Heard's motion, the jury verdict against Depp on the counterclaim cannot be reconciled with the jury verdict against Depp on the subsequent jury verdict against Heard on all of Depp's claims, according to Deadline. According to the legal papers, according to Deadline, the jury must have come to the conclusion that Depp did not mistreat Heard and that Heard deliberately lied in accusing him of abuse in order to decide in favor of Depp. But the jury had to come to the conclusion that Heard had been honest about being a victim of Depp's domestic abuse in order to find in Heard's favor. Therefore, the judgment against Heard cannot stand. Both appeal requests will be decided by a panel of judges, and depending on their decision, either Depp or Heard may then appeal the case to the state's highest court.